May I talk with you that's trouble with a problem today? I'm more concerned now about the condition of our young folk and some of the old too. In this new day and new time, we find so many of our folk, especially the young ones who have strayed and have allowed their fleshly wants to lead them astray. Dope peddlers, reefers, marijuana, and all the bad drugs it takes to destroy the mind. I wish it was so that someone somewhere with a listening ear would kindly pass these words in the streets and in your home and wherever you might be at this moment. Tell them Willingham said, let the bad drugs alone. For truly and surely as you born, it is not good for one to become habitation because I've seen them in the hospitals and I've seen them in a condition in the street that they couldn't help themselves. It makes me awful sad sometimes to look at someone who are helpless without a cause. Well now, don't you know that you ought to leave those drugs alone? because every human being that has a habit. I want to remind you that you also have a soul to be saved. And now, uh, when you allow the flesh to take over, when you allow yourself to become involved, then uh, my Bible says, hey God, mm -hmm, uh, lift me up from the earth. And uh, I've drawn in unto me. My God is pleading with you today. The Holy Spirit is begging you right now. Do away with your bad habits. And uh, think about that good old soul that you have. That God gave you your own health and strength. Gave you the knowledge and wisdom that you might be able to speak like others speak. Most of you come out of an intelligent family. Mothers have been made to cry about their daughters. And uh, fathers have been made to buckle down on their bending knees late at night because of their sons. But I'm begging and pleading. Son, will you come home? Daughter, will you give it up? Son, will you come home? Daughter, will you give it up? Son, will you come home? Daughter,